Hey, Shalom Amakim. Today's Hebrew word is all. Here's how it's spelled in the Assyrian. And it means unto, toward, or into. This is Genesis chapter 1, verse 9. And the power said, let the waters under the heaven be gathered together unto one place and let the dry land appear and it was so the first word we have here is wa ya amar the root word here is amar which means to say wa at the beginning of the word means and ya at the beginning of the word means they or he so it'd be and they said or and he said Next we have Alahayim, which is powers. Next we have Ya Kwawawa. The root word here is Kwawa, which means to wait. Now, when you wait for someone or for something, um, in a figurative sense, you expect uh, for that thing or that person to come. And so uh, when two people expect one another, uh, they become attracted or uh, or they gather uh, together. And so in this case, the waters waited for or looked for or expected one another uh, figuratively, of course. Thus, they were gathered together. And so literally, Ya Kwawawa means they will be gathered together because you have the Ya at the beginning and the Wa at the end, which makes it they will be. Next, we have... Ha Mayam. Mayam is the root word which means waters or water. And Ha at the beginning of the word means the. Next is Ma Thachath. Thachath is the root word which means under. Ma at the beginning of the word means from. Next is Ha Shamayam. Shamayam is heavens. And ha at the beginning of the word is the. And then we have the Hebrew word of the day, which is all, which means unto. Ma kwawam is place. Achad is one. Next is wa tha ra'a. Ra'a is the root word here, which means to see or to appear. Wa at the beginning of the word means and. Tha at the beginning of the word means she will. So it's figuratively uh, referring to the dry land. Ha yabasha is the next word. Yabasha meaning dry land. Ha at the beginning of the word means the. Next is wa yahaya. The root word here is haya, which means to be. And so we have Haya, the last two letters, uh, means basically it was made or it was. And then Wa at the beginning of the word means and. So it would be literally and he was made or and it was made. And then the last word is Khan, which means so or thus. So with that, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory due unto Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Basham Rachak Wadash, the honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and peace and citations to the elect. Shalom.